George Timothy Clooney, an American actor and filmmaker, and an Oscar-winning actor, broke his silence on his spiritual and religious status. George Clooney now identifies himself as an agnostic atheist. However, this is not where his spiritual journey began. Clooney was born in Lexington, Kentucky, in 1961. His mother, Nina Bruce, was a beauty queen and city councilwoman. His father, Nick Clooney, is a former anchorman and television host, including five years on the AMC network. Clooney is of Irish, German, and English ancestry. Clooney was raised a strict Roman Catholic, but said in 1998 that he did not know if he believed in heaven or even in God. He said, yes, we were Catholic, big time, the whole family, the whole group. In fact, he began his education at the Blessed Sacrament School in Fort Mitchell, Kentucky. He attended St. Michael's School in Worthington, Ohio then Western Row Elementary School, a public school in Mason, Ohio, and St. Susanna School in Mason, where he served as an altar boy. In an interview on The Larry King Show in 2006, Clooney recalled his Catholic upbringing. When asked about his religion, Clooney said this, I was an altar boy, did the whole thing. Latin masses too. I got into trouble a couple of times when I was young because I asked some interesting probing questions, you know. I thought it was in- an interesting idea when I asked when I was a kid. I would say things like, well, without Judas, this whole thing doesn't work. So I thought to myself, well, maybe Judas understood that it was his job and he actually decided he would be the traitor. And I've written a piece like that. It was just experimenting. I got into a lot of trouble for that. I don't have a specific religion. I don't. It's an interesting thing. I'll tell you what's tricky about this. In talking about religion, if you're well known, anything you say sort of ticks off a bunch of other people and sort of attacks their belief. So I always try to say this, first and foremost. I think that what is real and what really matters is whatever anybody believes, as long as it doesn't hurt anyone else, as long as it is fair enough, and as long as it works for them. I don't happen to have those beliefs as much. I don't believe in those things. Clooney expressed that the topics of one's faith, religion, God, spirituality, and ideology are sensitive taboo topics for many. Clooney has always been respectful of other belief systems. Clooney's sensitivity and respect for religion are hard to deny. Since this interview, Clooney has stayed pretty much quiet on the topic of religion, but his perseverance for speaking the truth lives on. Clooney created the Clooney Foundation for Justice, an organization that fights human rights injustices for those suffering, regardless of religious belief, gender, sexual orientation, politics, age, race, heritage, and more. The organization offers legal aid in more than 40 countries worldwide. Clooney's moral compass certainly guides him to learn, heal, and most importantly, listen to others. In a separate interview, Clooney praised his parents for providing him with a strong moral foundation. He said this, My mother and father were involved and we were taught that it is our civic duty to do this and to do that. I remember my father saying, don't come back and look me in the eye unless you stand up to bullies and racists, any racists. 
I am glad and grateful to have been raised that way. <laughs>